click the conference icon at the bottom of the screen. It changes your view, and at the top you see schedule or web conference. You do need an additional appliance to use the web conference, but to schedule a conference, as long as your system administrator has set this up, you can use the schedule conference button to send an email to people that you would like to have in your conference call. Name this conference call. It could be a one-time conference or ongoing. I'm going to use a one-time conference. Pick the date and the time. The duration is not how long the conference call will be open. It only blocks out the time on your Outlook calendar or whatever calendar you might be using. I'm going to leave this at 30 minutes. Web collaboration is that extra appliance that I mentioned. That is the MX meeting. Uh, so if you do not have that, you would leave this set to none. End call on host leave means when I would hang up because I'm the one establishing this conference call, all other callers would be disconnected. If I uncheck this, I can actually create a conference, be a part of it for a while, hang up, and my other callers could continue to talk. I'm going to leave that checked. And when I hit save and invite, it will open up an email form with the information that each of my callers needs. And here is that email. I can invite all my callers, either an outside or internal. Here's the half hour duration that it blocked out. Outside callers would need to call this number plus the conference ID. Internal participants could call an extension number this email needs to be set up by your system administrator. Let me close this out and go back to Zach. Here is my scheduled conference call. When I click that, I have an option to start the conference. I'm going to pause on that for a moment and explain the other buttons. If I would need to edit this conference for any reason, say I need to back up the time or the duration or even the day, I can do that. I can even add more participants. I can click this invite button. It will pull up that email template and I'll be able to invite multiple people. And this is the delete button if I need to delete the entire conference. I'm going to go ahead and start the conference. You cannot start a conference more than 15 minutes away from the start time. When I click start, it will grab one of my telephone lines and establish my conference. Joining the conference now, please introduce yourself. So here is my conference call. I'm just waiting for everyone else that I invited to call into the conference. When they do call into the conference, I would hear a beep and their introduction. I could also click the dot, click participants, and I would visually see when my callers join this conference. I can mute individual callers. I can hang up on individual callers or to disconnect the entire conference, here's my hang up button. Let me go back to schedule conference and delete this conference call.